Folks, today I just want to talk about filter dryers and how they come about. Back in the um, 60s and 70s, as people were installing more and more air conditioning to more and more homes in the United States, they started realizing certain problems with non-condensables because people were pulling the vacuums, they were contaminating the system with air, they were checking the refrigerant. Sometimes as they was putting the copper together, uh, they would pick up particles of dirt, uh, debris, and what happens is this stuff would get into the system, it would contaminate it, it would kill the compressor, uh, block the orifices that they used in them days. It would, uh, a lot of times in them days they used what they call cap tube system, it would block all the capillary tubes. Then somebody in the 1980s had a brainstorm, let's invent a dryer that filters a refrigerant. I just want to point this out to you. This is the first page of the patent of the filter dryer and I want to point out it was actually the first day of the patent was put into the US Patent Office December the 21st 1982. The two gentlemen were the inventors was John P. Clark and Ernest W. Schumacher both of DeSoto, Texas and the people that they worked for at the time was Virginia Chemicals of Portsmouth, Virginia. And I just want to just bring this out. I'm just going to show you a couple of pages here of the patent. They really went through this. They helped the industry save billions of dollars from compressor failures, nowadays TXVs, pistons. Here's what's come out of it. Here is a, a biflow dryer. This is a molecular sieve, and, and as the refrigerant goes through there, it picks up moisture and contaminants. I just want to point this out to you real quickly. Biflow, meaning it goes both ways. And then here's a one-way. One-way is going to have this arrow pointed here, and it's going to have the word inland here. In my opinion, this is one of the most important things that helped the refrigeration industry was the filter dryers. If you have any questions about this, give us a call at Jones Air Conditioning, 239-596-5855. Go to jonesairconditioning.com, and if you like this video, please share, please subscribe, and please comment. Thank you.